I'm at a gypsy. Exactly. The only downfall I have with it is that we there is no off season anymore. They fucked up. They, everyone wants less races and there's more now. Yeah, it's like what? Yeah. How <laughs> with the risk versus reward? How well not even reward the risk all year. It's not like NFL MLB where you can just go to a batting cage, you know, hit. Dude, you're riding supercross day in and day out, outdoors, day in and day. How do you do that every day and not expect something to happen? Dude, oh, it's How? unbelievable the risk that you guys are exposed to. You're not to. in a fucking sim. You're not in a car where you can just hit fucking reset. There mm-hmm. is no reset when you're endoing through the fucking air. Dude. No. You know? It's just like, okay, fucking respawn. I'm fucking back alive. <laughs> There's no. no respawn, There's bro. no respawn. You respawn in the back of a fucking yeah, ambulance on your way or in a medivac yeah. yeah. and you're sucking on a whistle. Yeah. Respawn in six yeah. months. Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, it's just like, come on. You know, so now we go January to mid-October. Or Insanity, whenever. bro. It's insanity. There's so many things like, that. all right, we're about to go on like another hour tangent just yeah. off like this one topic. <laughs> but that was the thing where, again, it like, I almost was like, dude, stop making me talk shit on you. Mm-hmm. I want a media credential for next mm-hmm. year. <laughs> like, I don't want you guys to think <laughs> I fucking hate you. But it's just like, when you stand at a press conference and say, we have listened to the writers. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, which one? Mm-hmm. Which writer wants 31 fucking races? Just, I'm down to be wrong. Yeah. But I, I just don't know any. And they all, like, you guys talk to me. That's yeah. my job is to talk to these guys. No one wants 31 races. Mm-hmm. It doesn't make sense. And bro, the mechanics. It's like people... Oh, it do, never I've, ends. I've seen when I was working at JDR, crazy family yeah. disputes. Oh, like wives ringing team managers being like, this is a fucking joke. We've got a newborn baby and he can't come home. Yeah, bro, you miss one flight and you're fucking done for two. You don't see your family for two weeks. Yeah, It's insane it's, to expect it, that shit. Yeah. And our sport is even tougher because you fly commercial. Yeah. You know what I mean? You're not flying on private things right Dog after a flights. game. Yeah. You're, you're fucked. You're burning up two <clears throat> to three just travel days a week just flying because you're going commercial taking red eyes at yeah, 4 taking, a.m. yeah flights, just so like. he, yeah we've done it he's done it with JGR where it's just like you know we've done Glen Helen and fucking pin it to LAX to take a red eye back so yeah the just boys so you can, can be, be home yeah so they can be home like dude just for one day yeah yeah like come on and then they're back on the road on Wednesday you yeah. know doing the same grind it's it doesn't make sense if you could travel in luxury to where you can leave same day and go do it all like yeah that's different but we don't have the money to be able to do dude, that dude I'm friends of Formula 1 drivers that fly private everywhere yeah and they're fucking burnt out <laughs> yeah tough life man. so like if you're you know? if you're a Formula 1 driver that is burnt out from travel and you're flying private yeah yeah. Then there's like, imagine what it's fucking yeah, you like. You make your yeah. own schedule. Yeah. And they're but, still burned out. And even that, they, it's yeah. not fun. Like it's not, it's not, not good only to that, tr- travel that much. And not only that, their hospitality is Insane. better than a five-star hotel. Yeah. You yeah. know what I mean? You're not going to fucking. You have steak. They're not sleeping you at the Holiday Inn Express. for lunch at McLaren. <laughs> yes. It's insane. Yes. You're not in New Berlin, New York in Unadilla fucking, <laughs> you know, in a cow pasture. It's just, it's. They got good it, mushrooms yes. there though, apparently. Yeah. <laughs> 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 want to know but, uh, <laughs> they, uh, yeah it's just it, it's fucked I don't know and then you see you know I see sex in October 8th going quad quad at the Honda track and I'm just yeah. like fuck me man how do you <clears throat> yeah. well that and so uh, this is another point I hadn't thought about this until I was talking to Hill mm-hmm. for the, the podcast right and I think that this actually is probably one of WSX's biggest fucking ace in the hole mm-hmm. you can't ride you can't ride. You fly in on a Monday and you're doing press Tuesday, Wednesday, or Wednesday, Thursday. You get like one day to recover. You're mm-hmm. doing press Wednesday, Thursday. Then you're at the track Friday and Saturday. And then you're out. Yeah. You can't ride. And guess what? It's a great you schedule. can't ride. And you can't ride. And you can't ride. So we can all fucking relax. Uh, I know, yeah. And we ain't doing we ain't doing we ain't doing Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Yeah. Fly in on a dog shit flight. Then you race Saturday, fly out on a dog shit flight, maybe get home Sunday to have mm-hmm. one day. Then Monday, Tuesday, mm-hmm. Wednesday. Now, can you imagine if I just said that mm-hmm. 31 times in a row? What I just don't, that one week schedule. Mm-hmm. Imagine if I just sit here and say that 31 mm-hmm. fucking times, how ridiculous that would sound. That's reality. And then 
in the middle of those Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, three hours on a bicycle, two thirties plus two. I know. It's a That's suffer it's, fest. It's a sign. The it's, sport has just gone to this point where it's almost at like a breaking point mm-hmm. for guys. And you yes. see it, dude. You saw Dunge dip out early. You saw Ricky dip out early. You yeah. saw Villo dip out early. You saw mm-hmm. Stewie dip out early. Mm-hmm. Everyone's fucking leaving the sport. The Basically, the goal now as a Supercross rider is to come in, win three championships, make all the money, Get retire out. at 27. And then Get guess out. what? You're 27. You don't know what the fuck to do with no. your life. Like Dunge. No. But you're so used to that schedule. Now you're bored. Dude, a hundred percent. That's because you've lived off a drug since you were five years old, and that drug's gone. <clears throat> you have withdrawals. Yeah, you sit there and you're scratching your neck like a like an addict. You know, I go through that now, even just when I'm injured. You know, but the, yeah, I don't think they understand the the grind that goes into it. Yeah, I, they they have to know it because they're going through it themselves. Yeah, Dude, yeah Davey's yeah, yeah. going yeah, yeah. every single weekend. You know what I mean? Then yeah, they got the, Loretta's and they got all this stuff. So they got it's. But the Feld guys do 17 rounds, then they fuck off for the summer, right? Yeah. Then yeah. you got Davey doing 12, 12 rounds. 11, yeah. 12 rounds now, Yeah. plus Loretta's. And yeah. then during Supercross, he's doing fuck all. Yeah. Not, not that they're not doing anything, yeah. but like they're not. But they're not on the black it. Monday, yeah. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Yeah. No. And then the parts you got to go through. Like, <laughs> think about budget wise. And now I'm just thinking about like World Supercross, right? So Hill gets in, and it, it, it doesn't become about being the fittest because now to win in America it's like who's the gnarliest guy and well, there's a point in time there's a point where that's dope but yeah. there's a point where it's also super dangerous mm-hmm. like you said you know I, and, and I struggle with that now because like I feel like just me myself I feel like a pile of shit because I haven't done anything you've got that crazy guilt and that anxiety yes, that comes because last, you see sex and going quad quad and, and last week just sitting you know in Melbourne yeah it's cool to be there but I'm not riding my dirt bike I'm working in a hotel gym I'm running you know but I'm not fucking riding I'm not you know feeding that fix that I live off of during the week you know it's like I'm itching to wait to ride on Friday you yeah. know the states you you don't get that but i don't know there's got to be a there's got to be some sort of balance it's either you're all in or you're doing this over here where it's yeah you're just racing on saturdays yeah you know yeah i don't know but i don't like the way i feel right now i just been having beers and lattes at the moment i feel like I'm <laughs> too many gym beans yes yeah, so. too many gym beans welcome I feel, my world yeah, baby like, <laughs> hey you sound an awful lot yeah. like a podcast <laughs> 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 i need to get out of australia it's not good so um but yeah it's 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 too much mm. it's, t- it's just too much